Hey, I'm Drop Bear. And I'm Panda. And uh, together with Drop Bear and Panda, we're here with the High Strung Downers. We are going to ask the High Strung Downers a handful of questions every day, Monday to Friday, while you guys are voting for High Strung Downers Lonely Mind on Story Hive. That's right. Thanks so much, and thanks for voting. Thank you. Uh, for myself, personally, was Blue Rodeo is one of my biggest influences. You know, not along the lines of, of the music we do, but uh, I'd have to say Blue Rodeo for sure. For me, it's uh, High Noon out of Texas, just because I really like their bass player. Um, he's someone that I've always followed and tried to kind of, not really copy the sound, but I think he's just highly skilled and, and yeah, just I love the way they sound. Great trio. For me, it'd be Ronnie Hayward. He's absolutely one of my complete favorites. His body of work is just outstanding right from country, hillbilly, rockabilly, jazz. Uh, he just All of his music totally inspires me. Uh, unquestionably, Charlie Feathers and Buck Owens are probably like two of the biggest ones. Probably because I suck at playing guitar, I think that's why I made it. It's um, true, he does. That was kind of my... Kind of my first love when I was a kid, so I kind of stuck with that. Yeah, for me it was uh, my grandfather. He was an up upright bass player uh, back in World War II. He was in the RAF and he was in a swing band. Um, and I'm also a drummer, and so just those two instruments were just, uh, they, all, uh, they all just always just kind of called to me. For me it was uh, definitely guitar for, because my grandfather as well, he was a big time player in the 50s and played on variety shows. His name is Earl as well. And my father, Glenn, um, we always had guitars laying around, so it was just the easiest thing for me to pick up. I'm still not very good at it, but uh, you know, it still works. Um, my answer would be almost identical to Earl's. My dad is a fantastic musician. There was always guitars around the house, and I always thought about it like some families are like hockey families or baseball families, and my family was like unquestionably a guitar and, and music family. So there was always guitars around, that's what I played. And my family, if you don't sing, you better know how to cook. I thought your family was a curling family. No. <laughs> curling second. That's what's guitar you know. first. Just curling. For curling. Curling <laughs> second. Probably my favorite Alberta band, which is uh, the Ray Gun Cowboys. I think they're one of the best songwriters and, and you know, just kind of like bands out there today. They have a huge sound and everyone should go see them if they're coming through your town. They're just a hard working band, yeah. I'm gonna back that up. Ray Gun Cowboys are wicked. Yeah. yeah, guys in Ray Gun are awesome and also I love watching our friends in Sam Spades, also a great Edmonton band who are insanely versatile, really good musicians and just all around good dudes. Other great bands that are out there that I really love. You know, guys in Mike Fury 4 are great and they work really hard. They're just total journeymen that are out there. I've, like, I, when I first moved to Calgary, I was enthralled with Mike Fury 4 and, like, I, when I get to play alongside those guys and when I get to play with these guys, it just always feels like I'm up in the big leagues. Um, Peter and the Wolves is another band that we have a lot of fun playing with. They're really great guys. Um, 427s. 427s, yeah. also. They're great guys, very organized, brilliant musicians. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're, they're awesome. Uh, so don't forget to vote for us on Story Hive. Um, there will be a link that's attached to this video. So just click that High Strung Downers Lonely Mind. Thank you so much to everybody for voting for us. Thank you to Drop Bear and Panda and Story Hive for just putting us here in the first place. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much.